I recently did a tutorial to show you how to check and see what is the active partition slot for your current Android device. And halfway through making that tutorial, I realized that not everyone who buys a smartphone, even today, will have a partition set up with both the A and the B partition scheme. Some devices only have an A partition scheme, and that's because Google is not requiring these companies to implement the feature, at least as of writing this. So, before you can take advantage of the tips that I want to do with the A and B partition scheme, I wanted to show you how to check to see if your device is actually actually has the dual partition partition system implemented. So I'm going to do that with an application that you can download from the Google Play Store. It's free. It's called Treble Check and it's going to put a little app icon called Project Treble in your app drawer and on the home screen. And I've talked about this application before to show you how to check to see if your device supports Project Treble. However, the A and B partition system is different than Project Treble. You can have one without the other. So I just wanted to revisit this application to show you how to check to see if your device has the dual partition system implemented. So I have a Google Pixel 2 XL right here. And when I open up Project Treble, first you have that Project Treble check up at the top, but the second one tells you if seamless system updates are supported. And that's just another name for the A and B partition system. Google calls this the seamless system updates feature. So if you have a green check mark right here, after you open up the Treble Check application, then your device has the A and B partition system, and you can take advantage of what that has to offer. However, I also have a device that I bought this year. Here is the Redmi Note 7. And whenever I open it, you can see it does support Project Treble, which is nice. However, it does not support seamless system updates, meaning that it does not have the slot A and slot B partition scheme. And it even tells you your device only has one set of partition, and it's only slot A. So seamless updates requires two sets of partitions referred to like I said, as slot A and slot B. So even though you're buying a new device in 2019 and even beyond, we could see this trend continue for another two or three years before Google requires it or it just becomes somewhat commonplace that all companies implement it. But as you can see right here, the Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 does not support the dual partition system and that is how to check to see if your device has slot A and slot B capabilities.